Welcome to I'll Eat That <laughs> with Blair and Matt. Welcome guys, welcome to Vlogmas today. These chips that you guys might have seen that we found at 7-Eleven. So we're going to do a taste test with a couple other goodies. Um, and we're going to try and hurry because I've shut the cat in the bathroom. And I don't know how long we have <laughs> until she escapes. But she is driving me crazy. Um, <laughs> Starting to get out. <laughs> no! Gotta go! <laughs> so we're going to start with the... Uh, I mean, we just have a couple of, like, little goodies. So we're going to start with the 7-Eleven. I want to start with the pumpkin pie chips. Um, it's weird, the idea of it. So, I don't know. Let's just, let's just do this. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, it's, oh, it's weird. It smells like pumpkin. It smells like pumpkin. It's weird. It smells like pumpkin. And That's you... actually not bad. They're subtle. Yeah. There's even a... After chip of a potato chip. After, After chip. chip. <laughs> After chip. Um, it's not bad. I wouldn't buy them again. But I don't hate them. See, like, crumbling them on top of ice cream? You know, like a little sweet and salty type of... I probably won't finish those, though. That's for us. All right. Turkey and gravy. Um, by the way, there is no turkey or gravy involved in this. It's all seasoning. Oh! It smells like gravy! Is that a good thing? Oh, it smells Pretty like sure. stuffing. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. oh, yep. Yep. I like that. That's weird. It tastes like stuffing. No, it tastes like gravy. Gravy. I like that. It's like, I'm just eating gravy right now. 7 out of 10. These were like a 4 or 5. You know what you could do? Make stuffing and crumble them on top. So what did I want this morning? Biscuits and gravy. <laughs> yeah. Here you go. Close enough. Gravy chips. I'm gonna keep with the savory theme. Oh, primal. I've tried this brand before. This is a, a vegan jerky. It's basically made out of like soy protein, wheat gluten, and seasonings. I have not tried this flavor. This is the hickory smoke <laughs> flavor. <laughs> There's a decent amount of protein in it. I don't buy these a whole lot. Well, bust her open. It smells like smoked. <laughs> it smells like smoked. So these have the consistency of like, uh, I don't know if you tried dried mango or something along those lines. It's pretty close to that a lot of yeah. times. You have, you have like a pool. But I mean, it does like... Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's it's like a... I can't really tear it. That's terrible. Huh? I like this one. A little smoky flavor. I like the texture. She. Oh, I see a face. Is, Is that, that her nose? Face? I don't know. I actually kind of like this one. Yeah? Yeah. See, it's pretty good. I, like I found all this those things. at Wheatsville, but I've seen them at like H E B Plus. Whole Foods always has them. So if you're like in a pinch and you need like a salty, savory, high protein snack, not bad. Seven out of ten. Next, we have this expensive nut cheese, tree line nut cheese, creamy soft French style herb and garlic flavor. Mm. Gluten-free, probiotic. Yeah, it's hey. Like, it's like 10 or 12 bucks. No soy day. or lactose. It was This one was $8.99. Oh, there you so go. this is like when you have people over and you want the fancy cheese, this is what you get. Oh, she fancy. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> so we have some pita chips to try it with. Oh, it smells like, like that other dip that we get. Do you want to hold it so it doesn't get hairy? <laughs> this is our life right now with the cat. Just hairy cheese. Ooh, ew. It's a little thick. <laughs> I can do some things with that. Like put it on a burger. Like a Beyond Bird, put it on the bun. You I like this. this. Oh, yeah. Dang. Good texture. Great flavor. It's like a good cream cheese. Made from fine cultured cashews. Oh, they're cultured. So these cashews are cultured, you guys. They go through all of the cultural training. Yeah, more cultured than I am. I don't mind spending eight dollars on that. It's like you take that out to a party, and you only let your close friends and family have it. It's like you got to make sure that they appreciate that since it's so expensive. Stop it! More. That'll. I mean, seriously, if you're not vegan, or if you're a vegan and you want to like have some people enjoy dairy-free cheese, that is that is the good stuff. 
like some type of dip or like a cheese ball type of thing. Cheese balls are classy. Dairy Queen. But <laughs> I saw it <laughs> loosening up. There you go. I'm gonna save that for later. Nine out of ten. Ten out of twenty. <laughs> Just kidding. I think it's a ten. I, that's good. That's a ten. That's a ten. I mean, ten well, out of ten. Think about other things like what? It. Calm down. I can't even talk to you. It was good. On that note, this was eight ninety nine. There was one that was eleven ninety nine, and I'm wondering how much better that one is. How much better could it be? We're gonna find out. I don't know. This is the last thing. These are little coconut milk car caramels. Coconut bites. Sea salt flavor. Luscious. Yeah. Makes little, little nuggets. You get one? I get one. Oh. That is not the texture I was expecting. Crunchy on the outside. Very chewy. Caramelly <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> on the inside. This is like those little chocolates that you get in the box and you always hope for the caramel one. Hello? Kitty? Hi. She sounds like she's fighting. Is someone in there with you, Kitty? <laughs> now twice, if so. She was in a tussle with something. A tussle? Yeah. Oh man. I'm sorry. <laughs> Meow twice if somebody's in there. <laughs> so what are your thoughts on this little guy? You're good. Me? Oh wait, I can't really. I wanted to show you guys. It crumbled. It like milk duds. It crumbled. I was trying to show you guys. <laughs> yeah, they're milk duds. Mm-hmm. I they are like milk duds. I give these because I love sweet. Nine and a half out of ten. Like a seven. I'm relating it to things I know. I didn't know milk duds. It's pretty close to it. It's really close to a milk dud, but I like to think it's better for you because all the ingredients on the back I can pronounce them and I know what they are. Chocolate, coconut milk, brown rice syrup, cane sugar, sea salt, vanilla extract, Tenth of gum. It's all organic. So that means it's magical. Really good. All right. Okay. Okay. I'm falling apart back here. I think that's going to be it for this taste test. Thanks for watching me eat breakfast. Yeah, I know. Because that's what I just did. That was my breakfast, <laughs> that was I my guess. That breakfast. What, or lunch. It's like noon. Oh, my God. <laughs> that wedding oh knocked goodness. us out. That was rough. That was a rough day yesterday. Oh, wait. Give me some more of that nut cheese. We already opened the bag of turkey and gravy. We're gonna go finish our lunch slash breakfast. Vlogmas is going strong still. We hit a little speed bump yesterday. Thank you guys for watching. Sharpies. If you've tried any of these, let us know in the comments below and let us know what you thought. Are there any other cool slash weird little vegan treats or snacks that you would like for us to try? I'm down to do more taste test videos. I yep. really like these. We'll call the segment, I'll eat that. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Welcome to I'll Eat That <laughs> with Blair and Matt. Mm -mm. I'll Jesus. eat that. All right. Merry Christmas. Bye. Bye. Oh, <laughs> that was so crazy.